Hi, Jamie here from The Hedge Teacher. How many of you out there are saying, I want to be my own boss? Come on, tell me. Well, you're not alone, and the numbers of us out there are growing every day. So what are we going to do about it? We're going to say it again and again and again until we do something about it. Yes, I want to be my own boss. I want to be my own boss. Yes, I want to be my own boss. And this describes the unheard heart cry of those who want to be their own boss, but do not know where to start and how to take the first step. More than ever before, people are discovering that secure lifetime jobs never really exist, especially in this present economic climate. The situation has given rise to a strong determination and motivation for many people to create their own jobs born out of what they have a passion for. Becoming your own boss is something that you can achieve. You only need to take courage from the super successful entrepreneurs in our world today. If they can rise to become what they are today, regardless of circumstances, you can do even better. So, waste no more time. Let's get started with these top tips. Tip number one, make a firm decision. If you're already unhappy with a vicious cycle that your life has become, then it's time to take a stand and make a decision. Keeping in mind that only you can make the change that you want. Playing the blame game won't help. It will only aggravate your situation. You blame your boss for overusing you, the economy for taking a bad turn. Blame your family for not being descendants of wealthy ancestors. The endless blame game. Change doesn't come by accident. It comes through conscious decisions, study, hard work and effort to make it happen. Tip number two. Determine the business that's right for you. Don't dabble into venture because someone has done well in it. Take a self-exploratory journey to uncover your real passion, your traits, your personality and other unique qualities that you possess. You can only persist and not lose hope when things are not going well in a business if that business has been chosen based on your passion and life goals. Here's a little look into how to choose what businesses to get into when you want to be your own boss. Look into your natural abilities, your potential, your acquired skills. Consider the areas you excelled in while working for others. Explore some of the hobbies you're passionate about. Consider businesses and investments that seem to stay with you no matter how hard you try to free yourself from them. Identify a gap in a niche or industry and come up with a unique way to fill that gap. And come up with a more practical solution to a long lasting problem. Tip number three, plan and plan. Success doesn't come by accident, it happens through great planning and relentless strategic efforts. No matter what businesses you choose to go into, good planning must precede good success. Besides, planning gives birth to confidence, focus and clarity. The business you intend to go into will start taking shape and become real as you pen down your strategies, your goals and your action steps. Finally, as you plan to become your own boss, ensure you identify your target audience before creating any product or service. Be sure you have an audience for the product or service you intend to create. In essence, do your own research to identify those who are in need of your service so that they can develop strategy to reach and teach them successfully. Please don't keep this a secret. Like, subscribe and share this with your friends and family. We have to hedge our own future and we don't look after ourselves.
There's no one out there who is going to do it for us. Until next time, this is Jamie at The Hedge Teacher.